Well, if you'll take out your message notes, I want to welcome you to our new series called History Makers, Lessons on Living by Faith. In the next five weeks, we're going to give a complete overview of the major characters of the Bible. I want to begin with this question, which is this. Why did God give us the Bible? And the answer is, one of the reasons, is for your encouragement. The Bible says this, Romans 15, verse four. For everything that was written in the past was written to teach us so that through endurance and the encouragement of the scriptures, circle that, the encouragement of the scriptures, we might have hope. You gotta have hope to cope. You gotta have hope to live in life. And where do you get hope? You get it from encouragement. And encouragement comes from the Bible. The more you get into this word, the more hope and the more encouragement you're gonna have. Now why do we need encouragement? Well, duh, life is hard. Everybody agrees with that? Life is not easy, life is hard. This is not heaven where everything works perfectly. This is earth where nothing works perfectly. So we all need encouragement. The Bible tells us that this life on earth is the preparation stage for heaven, that this life is the character building stage where God builds your character that you're gonna keep with you for eternity. And how does God build your character? He does it through tests. One test after another. Life is simply a series of tests. Big test, little test, long test, short test, major test, minor test. Right now, you're in one of three positions. You either just came out of a major test, or you are in a major test right now, or you're getting ready to go into the next one. <laughs> because you're always in some kind of test. Now, the good news is this. Every problem has a purpose. Now, God doesn't have to plan your problems. You plan enough of them yourself. You cause a lot of your own problems and the other people, problems that are caused in your life are caused by other people. God doesn't cause the problems in your life, but God has a purpose in every problem in your life and he will use it for good if you'll give it to him. 